Greetings, auto Intel enthusiasts. Let's explore the Tesla Model 2, a vehicle poised to redefine the electric vehicle landscape through advanced battery technology, cost optimization, and innovative design. Our objective at Tesla is to continually enhance our vehicles, ensuring each iteration surpasses its predecessors in performance and affordability. Consider a battery enhancement for the Model 2 that increases its range by 20% while reducing costs by $5,000. This could enable a base price below $25,000, positioning the Model 2 as a disruptive force in the U.S. affordable EV market. By transitioning from a $1.57 per kilowatt-hour lithium-iron phosphate (LFP) battery to next-generation sodium-ion cells at $40 per kilowatt-hour, Tesla achieves savings exceeding $800 on a 53-kilowatt-hour pack. Can Tesla leverage this technology to undercut competitors and challenge internal combustion engine vehicles? Let's dissect the technical details with Auto Intel. The Model 2 is engineered for mass-market adoption, embodying a compact, performance-oriented, and cost-effective electric vehicle. Configured as a five-door hatchback, it measures approximately 4 meters in length, shorter than a Volkswagen Golf but with interior volume comparable to a Model 3, owing to a skateboard-style battery architecture and maximized wheelbase extension. Its aerodynamic profile, with a drag coefficient estimated at 0.23 or lower, optimizes energy efficiency for highway driving. The use of lightweight composite exterior panels maintains a curb weight near 1,600 kg, despite a 55 to 60 kWh battery. Tesla's chief designer, Franz von Holthausen, indicates the Model 2 will adopt a streamlined silhouette akin to the Model Y, featuring a clamshell hatch for urban parking accessibility. Supplier data reveals a three-piece cast rear structure, diverging from single-piece gigacasting to reduce repair costs and capital expenditure for entry-level trims. Internally, cost-saving measures include smaller alloy wheels, reducing expenses by $500, single-pane side glass, and a monochromatic ambient lighting system, replacing the Model 3's 256-color array. The cabin employs unheated, non-ventilated fabric seats, saving an additional $500, and a simplified audio system with 7 to 9 speakers, compared to the 15 plus in premium Tesla models. The hatch operates manually, and the hood uses bare metal, further trimming costs without compromising structural integrity. The battery system is a cornerstone of the Model 2's value proposition. The production baseline incorporates a 50 kilowatt hours LFP pack, delivering approximately 310 miles of real-world range and a 10 to 80 percent charge time of 20 minutes on Tesla's V3 supercharger network. However, the potential adoption of sodium-ion chemistry could revolutionize performance and cost metrics. Tesla's mission to accelerate global decarbonization necessitates vehicles priced below $30,000. While LFP cells are cost-competitive, sodium-ion technology leverages abundant raw materials, sodium derived from soda ash or seawater, eliminating reliance on cobalt and nickel. This reduces packed costs to $40 per kilowatt-hour, yielding savings of over $800 for a 50-kilowatt-hour system, sufficient to integrate advanced driver assistance hardware or further lower the base price. Sodium ion cells exhibit an energy density of approximately 160 watt hours per kilogram, surpassing LFP's 110 to 130 watt hours per kilogram, enabling a range increase to nearly 370 miles without altering the pack's physical footprint. Additionally, sodium ion chemistry supports high charging currents, particularly in sub zero conditions, reducing the 10 to 80 percent charge time to 10 minutes, enhancing user convenience. Performance benefits extend beyond range. The increased energy capacity enhances powertrain dynamics, reducing the 0 to 60 mph acceleration time from 6 seconds to approximately 5.5 seconds. Sodium ion cells demonstrate exceptional durability, sustaining over 6,000 full charge discharge cycles before degrading below 80% capacity, double the lifespan of LFP packs. In extreme cold, 
sodium ion retains 95% capacity at minus 30 degrees C, compared to LFP's 70%, ensuring consistent performance in harsh climates. Cost reductions are significant, with a 50 kilowatt hour sodium ion pack costing $2,320 versus $2,850 for LFP, a $530 saving that could either bolster margins or reduce consumer pricing. By eliminating cobalt and nickel, Tesla mitigates supply chain volatility and ethical sourcing concerns, leveraging sodium's abundance to stabilize production costs. Tesla's prior adoption of LFP cells for the Model 3 in China in 2021, initially met with skepticism, proved successful for its durability and affordability. Internal R&D reports from Q1 2025 confirmed sodium ion Model 2 packs achieved 160 watt-hours per kilogram, 6,500 cycles, and zero thermal runaway up to 400 degrees Celsius, with V3 superchargers enabling consistent 10-minute 10 to 80% charging without accelerated cell degradation. Addressing exaggerated claims, such as 5-minute charging or 100-fold energy density improvements, requires scrutiny. Contemporary lithium-ion batteries deliver 200 to 300 watt-hours per kilogram. Sodium-ion cells, initially at 130 to 160 watt-hours per kilogram, reached 175 with CATL's Naxra cells in April 2025, with projections of 200 by year-end. A 100-fold increase to 15,000 watt-hours per kilogram approaches gasoline's energy density, an unattainable target within current electrochemical limits. Even a 10-fold increase to 1,750 watt-hours per kilogram exceeds present capabilities. Sodium ion's practical advantages lie in its cycle life, charging speed, and low temperature resilience. Compared to alternatives, sodium ion competes favorably. Aluminum graphene batteries offer 200 to 300 watt hours per kilogram and sub 10 minute charging but face scalability challenges due to anode byproduct issues. Iron air batteries, at 50 to 100 watt hours per kilogram, suit stationary storage but not EVs. BYD's blade LFP cells, at 160 watt hours per kilogram, prioritize safety and deliver 250 to 300 miles of range. Standard LFP remains cost-effective at 120 to 160 watt-hours per kilogram with 3,000 cycles. Sodium ions improving density, affordability, and cold weather performance position it as an ideal candidate for the Model 2. Manufacturing is a critical enabler. Tesla's unboxed assembly process reduces production costs by 50%, targeting a bill of materials below $20,000. The Model 2 will commence production at Giga Shanghai, leveraging local LFP supply from CATL to avoid tariffs, followed by expansion to Europe and Texas. Shanghai's production line assembles a Model Y in 33 seconds, the Model 2, with fewer components, could achieve 20 seconds, enabling a capacity of 10,000 units per week, double the Model 3's peak output. Fremont and Texas will support U.S. production with parallel lines operational by June 2025 for rapid market delivery. The battery employs BYD-style blade LFP cells, integrated into a structural pack to minimize weight, with a chemistry-agnostic design allowing seamless integration of sodium ion or 4,680 cylindrical cells. Tesla's modular Gigafactory lines enable rapid chemistry transitions, minimizing downtime. A limited early access sodium ion Model 2 is planned for mid 2026, with a full launch by late 2026, aligning with California and EU climate mandates. Market implications are profound. A $24,995 US base price, post fees, and modest margins undercuts competitors like the Chevrolet Bolt EUV and Nissan Leaf by thousands enhanced by Tesla's 6,000-plus supercharger network and full self-driving hardware. In Europe, a 28% surge in EV registrations in early 2025, driven by sub-$28,000 models like BYD's Dolphin, underscores demand for affordable EVs. 
The Model 2, with a potential $7,500 U.S. federal credit, could reach $22,500, rivaling gas-powered vehicles like the Nissan Versa. Competitors such as Volkswagen's ID.2 all face delays to 2026, providing Tesla a market window. In China, a $23,600 to $25,000 Model 2, with tax exemptions and waived license fees, could hit $21,500, competing directly with BYD. Tariffs significantly influence pricing, Texas or Mexico production qualifies for U.S. credits, maintaining affordability, whereas Shanghai-built units face 100% U.S. tariffs, inflating costs to $60,000 to $65,000. In Europe, Berlin's 10% duties and incentives like France's $4,300 bonus yield a $22,900 price. India's 15% tariff for sub-$35,000 EV supports a $24,300 price point. Lithium price fluctuations, down from $81,000 to $14,000 per ton, further optimize costs, with every $1,000 shift impacting pack costs by $300. The June 2025 production timeline is substantiated by robust evidence. Drone footage from April 2025 captured fully camouflaged Model 2 prototypes at Giga Texas, exhibiting a shorter wheelbase than the Model Y, indicative of pre-production validation. Reuters 2024 supplier quotes for the Redwood crossover confirm a 10,000-unit weekly target by June 2025. Tesla's Q1 2025 SEC filing affirms production commencement in the first half of 2025 on existing lines. A camouflaged right-hand drive Tesla spotted in India, alongside earlier Texas sightings, aligns with a global validation campaign. The Model 2's single motor, utilizing ferrite magnets, reduces costs by $1,000 compared to the Model Y's $2,000 rare-earth motor, balancing performance and affordability for urban commuting. What are your thoughts? Will the Model 2's advanced battery technology, cost-efficient design, and strategic production redefine the EV market? Can it displace internal combustion vehicles with its pricing and capabilities? Share your insights below, and thank you for tuning into Auto Intel. Like, share, and subscribe for the latest Tesla EV developments. Until next time.